now that I told you that you have to in this step two, you have to do your UWorld questions and add on the information to your base notes. But the question comes, how do I even approach UWorld, right? Should I do it on tutor mode? Should I do it on exam mode? Should I do it system wise or random? How, how do I do it? Because I have to do it once, right? So how do I even do it? And how do I even carry all the syllabus together? I hear this quite doubt a lot of times that I did CVS two months ago and currently I'm on CNS. But now when I try remembering CVS, I don't even remember the C of CVS. Now I feel I will have to go back to CVS again and then I will revise CVS. And while I do that, I will forget some other unit. So this is this is a vicious cycle which many students suffer with that they revise a particular unit and while they revise it, they forget the previous one because they, they put in a lot of gap between the two units. So this is where the basket framework comes in. It's, it's very simple. Step one, just read the one, read one unit from your note or FA. If you're doing step one, make it, it will be FA first step. If you're preparing for step two CK, it will be the pre-made notes or the Anki deck for that particular unit. Let's, let's take it CVS. Okay. So you went through the notes, you primed yourself with all the information that is in the CVS unit. Okay. And now you go to UWorld, you solve one to two blocks of that particular unit, CBS, on tutor mode. Nothing else, tutor mode, just you read something just now, you have to apply that knowledge and test your knowledge. Okay, are you able to solve the questions? What is going wrong? You just, you just read it, right? Why are you not able to solve the questions? Are you not able to apply that knowledge? Are you not able to, uh, I mean, uh, uh, diagnose the condition, right? What is going wrong? So solving one to two blocks, should give you enough confidence to approach this unit. Keep that unit in the basket. Okay. Next, we will go to another unit. We will do the same thing for the other unit. Let's take it, take it as renal. Okay. Exactly same thing. Prime yourself with the knowledge. Solve one to two blocks for that particular unit, renal, on tutor mode, and apply your knowledge. Now, when you are done, keep those two units in the basket. Okay, and solve one to two blocks on exam mode of both the systems combined. You did CVS, you did renal, you got confident in both of them. Now test them together on exam mode. Just one to two blocks, not more than that. I think that should be more than sufficient. Step four is again, repeat it for another, another unit. Go to CVS, prime yourself, solve one to two blocks of CVS on tutor mode, CNS, sorry, on tutor mode and be confident in that. Again, add it to the basket and do all the three systems combined on exam mode. Continue doing it till almost all of your units or at least most of your units get into the basket. So now you know that, okay, because you are, you know, you are compiling all of your units into the basket, you will be carrying the entire syllabus together when you will reach around 25 to 20, to 30 percent of your world so that will really help you build meaningful connections between the units because you know you are you are thinking holistically you 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 know that okay if this person has shortness of breath it could be renal or it could be serious it, it could be i mean a pulmonary so you will start making vital connections in your brain and very early on in the in your preparation phase you will get comfortable with the real exam pattern so and because you are taking the entire syllabus together there won't be any problem that okay i did cvs two months ago no you're just carrying the entire syllabus together every day you are solving at least few questions of each unit till the time you complete your you will 100 percent so that is all for from my side thank you so much for joining in and if you have any questions please uh, do let me know uh, you can drop in in the chat box or just open your mic and tell me if if you if you need uh, i have made more such videos on youtube so you can follow me there and you can check my videos if, if they are beneficial mm -hmm.